welcome to Aisha's DIY this is um, a box from Jill Weissman bead garage sale this is the last bead garage sale she has I think she still has some stuff left on the garage sale I will leave down the description below the link for the website but I just got my order today it happened on Saturday morning at 8 p.m. Pacific Standard Time and um, these are my orders pretty excited about it I got a couple of grab bags and then uh, some items I was I did um, place two orders uh, okay something was open I guess let me just put this away and later while I go through this. So, okay, this was the one which was an open bag. The ziplock was open, and this is a check glass grab bag button. Okay, we shall take care of this later. I'll just get organized and come back. I have totally um, seven grab bags I got. I think that's the maximum limit. So I got the maximum limit. $10 general grab bag limit two per person. I got two of those and then three of the check glass button grab bags and two of the seed bead uh, grab bag. The seed bead is $8. The button is $6 a bag and $10 a bag for the general one so this is a general grab bag so it's a it's, it's normally assorted and that's what i have seen i have bought from um, the garage sale that it happened last time so i'm very happy with whatever i got and these are some so i this is the last garage sale that she was ever gonna have so i thought i will take advantage of it so i got these uh, pearls these are freshwater pearls these are thin and they are the hole is in the center from top to down so these are the ones in this and for this it's ten dollars for all of this that's like a whole lot of thing right so I really like the money worth of it so these are the peanut beads I think these are the big ones. I have the small one. Let me show you guys. Uh, these are Japanese peanut beads. As you guys can see how small they are and how big these are. Right? I haven't seen um, peanut beads in this size. So that's a great addition to my stash and that's that and I really like these beads the one stripe ones um, like a candy beads these are six or eight beads those are that and these ones are soup duos vintage copper um, regular 10 grams it was nine dollars and 75 cents and it was in the grab bag that's so so that's awesome I guess you guys can see that clearly so this one is different this one is uh, pyro spar puka beads ancient gold yellow gold metallic there's only 37 in this this one is very different and I don't have something in my stash like that I have heard about this puka puka or puka Puka, I don't know. Puka beads. There we go. Then we have these. Um, I think this is Czech fire polished six millimeter bicone, and this one is I think three millimeter truck beads. I love truck beads, and this one is four millimeter. I think travertine color, and Picasso finish that's awesome and we have this I believe one millimeter leather 
a spool, small spool. Then this one is a focal, maybe a ceramic or yeah, I think it's a ceramic. It's not a gemstone. It's very shiny. Maybe it's a glass bead. You bet the drill, the hole is from side to side, just like that. Pretty. Then we have some glue on veils. So for example, if this is a stone, what you can do is you can just add some epoxy or um, E6000 glue here and then just keep this on top. This will form a pendant for you guys. So those are glue on veils. Good to have. And then some seed beads, delica beads. That's really nice, delicas in the brown color chocolate brown light chocolate german chocolate brown and head pins are always welcome i love i mean i i really run out of head pins like nobody's business even though i like to make my own head pins i really like the store-bought ones as well the the temperament of the wire is perfect for us to do and especially the ones that has that are very uniform i really like them so that's a very good one and we have some more truck beads bead strand three millimeter i guess very nice color then these are i don't know what kind of a bead is this this is foggy and frosty outside and there is inside like a light orange terracotta color very pretty one then we have some findings or tags maybe these are glued tags they have glued heart shape in it copper and silver that's different and then we have some small truck beads i think these are one millimeter but pretty metallic purple color that's nice then we have these it's lamp work beads these are glass beads foil glass beads cute then then we have some super duos in a very um, pretty color I don't think so the camera is picking up but there is a blue hue to it it's very pretty it's because of finish I'm I'm really I really want to do a pattern super duo that I was really excited about recently that I made I'll show you guys I haven't made a video on that but I did make this cute um, pattern it's ladder stitch with um, super duos it's bead weaving so very very pretty and I added a nice bell and a pendant to it this is for Halloween series that I made so that's coming up and I can use up these um, I can do blocks of these super duos that will be very nice then we have some size 11 Japanese seed beads nice nice um, nice pack it's not less it's nice and then we have some caged beads. These are caged beads that we normally make with wire. See that? So we can make this caged beads for the beads that doesn't have holes as well. So those two are that. Then we have some seed beads. I think these are delica, yeah, delica beads in the green metallic color. And then we have Delica beads in this lavender color which I really like and 11 size 11 Japanese seed beads in this uh, 
cat's eye kind of a color so we have two hamsa charms in bronze finish and last but not least ginkgo beads in the milky white color very little but nevertheless see how many bags we have several of them right and the bail and then this one right here and also these ones these are half tilas oh my goodness Tr matte transparent crystal half tilas that's cute that's that's really i don't have tilas at all just for one and also we have this one I remember I got something similar to this in Sam Speedbox. The color combination is really, really pretty. It's like a candy that you can pop in your mouth and 6mm truck beads and the color is amazing. Let's see what it says. Check 5 polished beads, opaque 5 color luster. It is lustrous. So all of these for $10. You can't go wrong with that amazing value for the grab bag but there is a limit for these grab bags so only two bags per person and all of these all of these you can see all of these in one bag i'll open the next bag the second bag all of the items the grab bags the general grab bag the second bag is this so we have some some super duos in a blue metallic color and a nice stash this is 10 grams i guess of matte opaque glazed grape size 11 delica beads that's really cool and then we have some more super duos in the red color and then we have size 11 Mayuka seed beads, um, Mayuki seed beads in the black metallic gunmetal color. That's that. Then we have more size 11 Mayuki Japanese seed beads in the green. This is forest green, I believe. Then we have half tilas in forest transparent green color, half tilas. And uh, then we have some peanut beads again in this iridescent color like a green like warm um autumn color i would say that one then we have some delica beads silver lined glazed dark saffron ab this was seven dollars and five cents it seems and these ones are lentil beads which has a top drilled hole very pretty and this one is a truck check glass truck three millimeter strand red color we have some um like light golden color i think this is <coughs> this is four millimeter maybe this is three millimeter and oh this is so cute i love this beads i don't know what they are but they are like candies oh these are heart beads and they have side to side drilled holes and the stripes is very very gorgeous amazingly pretty that's that then this is the beads i don't know what that means it says the beads and these are cute these are ceramic beads nice mix right there i don't understand the name the beads see but they are good then we have a cross charm
Then we have a flower toggle clasp. Then we have some rhinestone roundels. So they have stones around the circumference or perimeter, whatever you call. I'm so sorry. It's been a while since I used all of those terms. So here you go. Around it. Few of them. Then we have some truck beads in gunmetal color, four millimeter, and some kinko beads in the brown chocolate brown color. And some more truck beads in this olive green metallic color. And we have this tulip beads in this crystal color, one strand. And then we have these truck beads in the purple metallic color. I think we got it in the last uh, grab bag as well. Then we have some size 11 Japanese seed beads. See one, two, three, four, five, five packs there. And 1.5 millimeter leather spool. And Greek pewter five dollars star charm. This Greek pewter. I don't understand. But these are star charms. They are embossed on one side and flat on the other. That's that. Then we have some, these are gem duos, mini gem duos. Then, wow, this butterfly is very pretty. I hope this is check glass and it's a cabochon. I think, yes. If you do bead embroidery around it, I think it will be awesome. Then we have a pendant, a flower pendant. That's the bale behind. And then finally, last but not least, an awesome button, you guys. Check glass button. Huge button. Look at that. How pretty they are and how big they are they heavy as well and it retail for six dollars that's so cool the design very pretty button I love it so these are the uh, items in the second pack so I got three check glass grab bag button um, so three bags was the maximum allowed this one broke so this is a huge amethyst button and I think this is amethyst because it is heavy and I really like these ones and this one is a little bit heavy as well I think this is a dragonfly this one is a star very pretty both sides are pretty it's chipped uh, no the color has gone a little bit but this side is prettier than this okay. right and this one is uh, these ones are regular buttons but nevertheless they are gorgeous and this one is a cat I guess very pretty like vintage pink color and this one's a two hole button like a crystal button this one is a cat button that's cute and this one is a suitcase or bag button laptop bag and this one is similar to this I guess this is a two hole button I really like this button as well this uh, swirl effect 
and this is also very cute heart shaped button with three flowers in it okay this is a first bag the second is this and this is button I don't know yeah it's like it looks from short kind of a button but this one is pretty this one is prettier yeah this is cute as well these are huge black buttons this one is purple I hope the camera is picking it up the square buttons is also nice this one is pretty this one we had a matching in that see if this is smaller this is a little bit bigger oh clock button that's cute this one is also cute so many buttons I like this one this one is cute we can put a shut on in it oh this is a dog button that's so adorable <laughs> so that's the second bag let's open the third one this is a humongous button that's pretty flower this is similar to the one that we already got and this one is plain but it has that smooth and we have one more cat with two rhinestones as ice this is a boat button and these are all shank buttons this is very cute as well and this is adorable so pretty the bird button and a flower it looks like ivory and this color is also really nice this is a regular button and this one is the ones that we got already and again another clock let me show the other clock for you guys look that's completely different right then this one is really cute it looks like a marble can you see that I hope the camera picked it up a crystal button small teeny tiny one last but not least this acrylic one so these are the buttons that we got in three grab bags i'll just put that aside and show you guys the japanese seed beads grab bag button in the seed bead grab bag there was totally five ten uh, sub blocks this one is japanese seed beads eight size is six and this is also size 8 and this color I really like it a lot and 11 Japanese seed beads both are 11's yeah this one is also 11 this one as well all are 11 so 5 of the 11's in different colors and 2 size 6 2 size 8 and 1 bugle spiral bugle beads six millimeter that's really pretty pretty color this is one the next one I'll open it so we have these are drops and size 8 so this is one bag this is drops this is size 8 this is size 6 mm, 
size 6 and 2 size 8, 2 size 6, 1 uh, here there was bugle and here there is straps and the rest are Japanese seed beads in different colors. Okay, we have 15 stores, so 2 15s and 3 lemons. 15s are the one I don't have that much. See these lemons as well, they are very pretty color as well. So these are the grab bags. I'll come back for our uh, purchase. There was like not the grab bags but the regular sale but it was during the bead garage sale. Hi friends, welcome back. I haven't shown you guys what I got from uh, Jill Weissman's the last bead garage sale apart from the grab bags. These are the ones. The first one is this gold plated toggle clasp with cubic zirconia. It's so pretty. I think it was expensive only some $4 or $5 I believe. But look at that. So pretty they are. I thought I will get at least one for myself. That's so pretty. So that one I got. And then I got these drop beads. These are Japanese seed beads. 2.8 millimeter drop in this lustrous cream color. So this is very cute. I really like them a lot. Especially when you are doing bead weaving and stuff like that. I'll show you guys how it is. See these are drops but doesn't look like drops. But these are very cute drops. See that? So pretty. And the cream color is very pretty. As well. So I got those. There is no price written on the on the receipt, so I'm not so sure how how do I check the price for these? But whatever I'm showing you guys here, it's about say sixty dollars uh, plus tax. I mean plus shipping. Shipping was four ninety nine, I believe, uh, for um, for um, all the grab bags, and then I did again a transaction because the last time I shopped at B Grad Sale, that was um, actually um, I waited to check out all other things. By the time I get back to it. The grab bags were gone, so I didn't want to take a chance this time. This is this is a turbine bead. Let me show you guys what it is actually. Um, so the 2.8 millimeter drop beads we saw, the crystal toggle clasp, gold plated 12 by 14 millimeter we saw, and three cut turbine beads, 8 by 10 millimeter white rose travel train. This is the one. This is the turbine beads. It's so antique. It's so awesome color. I really love this. Something magical about these beads. I am glad that I got this. But I got only one strand obviously. So that's a bummer. But I really like these beads a lot. And then um, we have this. Abrisk coin beads. Metallic red with gray. This, is, this might show as white. But it is actually gray. And has that metallic red wash to it so it's very pretty i have worked with some coin beads before like this from sam's bead box i really like them so i got that and then i got some bell flowers 5 by 6 millimeter gray blue black mix it's a quantity of 52 i thought the price was right so i bought these so pretty flowers and then i got this um check glass bead mix honey drizzle and it's an 85 gram like three ounce this also i remember getting it from sam's bead box uh, but this is um like i hope you guys also might might remember these leaves that we got uh, but these are two whole beads but these are not tile beads it's like a, a rhombus shaped and the holes are going this way it's a very nice mix I like this warm mix. I made one um, one necklace and earrings for myself. I still adore it. And 
everybody who ever sees it you can see that amber kind of a look to this bead it's really pretty all right these are also very nice the honey mix is pretty good and i really like the color um so i thought i'll just get this for myself and make something out of it that i will like to wear because um the thing is i really like long necklaces rather than short that's a personal opinion but i really like those and that color suits me well so this one is a pretty flower petal nice blue this one is um sea foam green actually that is what's called check glass flower petals 12 by 15 mm i really love those as well so i got that then we have turbine beads again i got one more turbine beads can you see that such a pretty blue i love this blue and in the sun it shows pretty well i like that so i got that and then um, okay that was flower petals turbine beads 10 amber turquoise opal glass sugar skulls halloween is around the corner so i got some skulls for myself that's cute to make some earrings very pretty so that one the next one is um hematite button this was i think two or three bucks but i liked this bronzy hematite one it has a shank behind and it is very pretty as well so i like that then i got one more button i got only two buttons which is this one right here 22 millimeter peacock glass button gold blue red on a white background it was much prettier in uh, the in the website than this the wash is all a little bit gone away the peacock looks pretty but i'm not happy with the outside and then 6 mm purple metallic silver silver spect quantity 25 this is fire polish again truck beads i got this one right here and let me see jim jet jet black with some red can you see the red that's awesome right it's completely different i really like those and then we have terracotta black this is terracotta black i like this color as well it's very unique it's not our regular colors so um then we have Silver spec jet metallic. One more silver spec I got for myself, which is jet and metallic. That is that. Then we have Aztec gold, four mm. Um, this is the one. Fire polish beads fifty. And 4 mm fire polish matte a dark aqua AB. Aqua AB. Which is this right here. The blues are gorgeous. And then aluminium silver. So this is the one. Then we have um six mm fire polish bicones which is this right here i'm okay with the color but i got only one of the six millimeter one then five mm fire polish bright blue vitriol color this is the one i like this color it's nice and bright 
and then a crown key I'm always fascinated by key I don't know why but I just buy them it's um, like I know it's like an addiction but I do love keys um ginkgo beads matte bronze apollo turquoise 7.5 by 7.5 mm quantity of 25 so that's pretty color and then we have some uh 4 mm cube beads very pretty color combination right multi color then we have 25 gram metallic bronze 60 seed beads that's nice i really wanted this color but this is a very quite rather a less amount but i really wanted it so i bought it so these are the stuff that i got from um jill weisman's bead garage sale the last bead garage sale she is ever going to ha have so i thought why not let me just get grab some which i like these are the ones that i bought other than the grab bags i hope you guys like this video if you do give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel don't forget to hit the bell icon for notification i do upload videos couple of times a week thanks so much for watching have a good day and bye i will leave down in the description box below the website details for the speed garage sale i hope they they have still stuff left in the sale